This video will demonstrate how to add a local search field in Primo. Primo maps information from fields in the source record to different sections of the PNX. In this example, the AVA subfield D is the source field in Alma, and the search LSR07 is the field in the PNX that will be indexed. There are 50 local search fields in Primo that are available for configuration. The newly indexed call number field can be added as the pre-filter search option for simple or advanced search. Step 1. Configure the normalization rule. Navigate from Primo Home to Advanced Configuration to Full Normalization Rule Configuration. In this example, the call number field will be added to the Alma underscore NR normalization rule. Click Edit to open the normalization rule editor. At the top of the page, check the box next to the Display Empty PNX option and then select Search from the PNX section drop down box. Scroll down through the list to the entry for Search LSR07 and click Edit to open the Normalization Rule Editor. Click the Create button to add a new rule. Enter the following parameters for the rule. Select OR as the action, choose MARK from the Source Type dropdown, enter AVA as the field, and D as the Include subfield parameter. The transformation will be left at the default, copy as is and the parameter field will be left blank. Document your work by adding call number to the comments and description fields and click Save. Return to Primo Home by clicking the link in the main menu. Click the Deploy All link and select the checkbox next to the entry called Normalization Rules. Click the Deploy button to deploy the changes to the normalization rule. Step 2. Run a pipe to write the call number to the PNX local search field 07. Navigate from Primo Home to Monitor Primo Status to Pipe Monitoring. Here you'll be able to view a list of all available pipes for your institution. Execute a No Harvest Update Data Source pipe to update the search LSR07 field in the PNX. In this example, the Alma underscore renorm pipe will be run. Click Execute to run the pipe. Note that after the pipe has completed, scheduled indexing will need to run before the fields will be available for search in Primo. Step number three, update labels for new search fields. Labels are customized in code tables. The label will be updated from LSR07 to call number. Navigate from Primo Home to Advanced Configuration to All Code Tables. Edit the Advanced Index Fields table. Filter by English and then by field code to find the LSR07 entry that will be updated. Click the Customize button to the right of the field entry and click OK when the pop-up message appears. Change the field name value from LSR07 to call number. This is the label that will display to end users. Save the label changes for the Advanced Index Fields code table by clicking the Save button. The page will return to the code tables list. Locate the Basic Index Fields table in the All Code Tables list and click Edit to open the table. Filter by English and then by field code to find the LSR07 entry that will be updated. Click the Customize button to the right of the field entry and click OK when the pop-up message appears. Change the field name value from LSR07 to call number. This is the label that will display to end users. Click Save and return to the list of code tables. Return to Primo Home by clicking the link in the main menu. Click the Deploy All link and select the checkbox next to the entry called 
all code tables and mapping tables, front end labels, and more. Click the Deploy button to deploy the changes to the code tables. After the deploy is complete, the field labels will be updated to call number. Step 4. Add the call number fields to a view. Navigate from Primo Home to Ongoing Configuration Wizard to Views Wizard. Edit the view where you would like end users to be able to search by call number as a pre-filter. We'll use the Train Alma view. Click the Edit button next to the view. The Edit View Attributes page will display. Click the Save and Continue button and the Search Scope list page will display. Click the Continue button and the Tab Configuration page will display. Click Continue once more and the Tile Configuration page will open. At the Tile Configuration page, choose Home page from the drop-down list and click the Edit Tile button to open the Advanced Search Tile. On the Edit Advanced Search Attributes page, edit the complex search line under the Define Pre-Filters section. Click OK when the pop-up menu appears. On the Edit Advanced Search Attributes page, select Call Number from the Search Value drop-down list and click Create to add the call number as a value for the pre-filter. Click the Save and Continue button. Click Save and Continue once more to return to the Tile Configuration page. On the Tile Configuration page, choose Home Page from the drop-down list and click the Edit Tile button next to the Basic Search tile. On the Edit Basic Search Attributes page, scroll down to the Search Operators section of the page and select Call Number from the Search Field Value drop-down list. Click the Create button to add the call number as a pre-filter option for the simple search. Click Save and Continue to return to the Tiles List page. Click Continue to deploy. Click Deploy Now to save and deploy changes to the view. Step 5. View Pre-Filter Options in Primo. Confirm that the call number search fields are displaying as pre-filter options in the Primo front end for simple and advanced search.